Welcome back to Josiah Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. I just uh, finally found the uh, the shop where Grayson is. I can pick this up and sometimes you just have to chuck some barrels around and manage to clear out a little inventory space for myself by selling some things. Oh, tires! That's what I need. Not really. Fifth Convention on Design and Industries. Okay. Here's a back alley with some unfortunate people in it. Why can I pick these barrels up? I mean, like, what's the gameplay purpose of being able to... And all the boxes, especially boxes in areas where there's really absolutely no reason to be messing with boxes. Is it just for consistency? Or is there literally some reason, like some, oh, here's a weird hidden area you can get to by stacking barrels a certain way and jumping on stuff? I don't know. Oh, hey, what's this? I just found hidden stuff. Detroit. Okay, my first thing in Detroit. Oh, I lied. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. I want to read this. Damn it! Here it is. The palace from crumbs at Yazura to L4 Brat. Oh, Lab Rat in uh, in Leedspeak to Lab Rat at Yazura. Hey, 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 Lab Rat! Listen, keep this to yourself so it don't get spoiled. But I've got my own little crib, the Crumbs Palace storage unit. The code to get inside is 4626. Dibs on the 40s, though. Touch them and you get the crumbs special. Crumbs. Well, this sounds like a high-class individual who, whose palace should certainly be visited. So, when I find this storage unit, I will use his code and steal all his stuff. And that was just, like, really hard to notice right there. I just happened to see it because I'm an explorer. I think most people would not ever find that. Hobo. Look at you, all ogged up. Can you fly with all that stuff? Human evolution took a wrong turn somewhere. You might say it was a human revolution. Human evolution took a wrong turn somewhere. These poor people, they don't seem to be enjoying their lives. I ain't no guinea pig. Ain't no way I was getting ogged just to keep my job. I ain't no guinea pig. Are you a guinea pig? Government's experimenting on people without they even know. Making super soldiers, man. Lazarus said so. Who's Lazarus? They did kind of experiment on me and made a super soldier of me without my permission, so you're right. Government's experimenting on people without they even know. Making super soldiers, Lord man. God Lazarus made you in his own so. image. Why would you desecrate yourself? I, I, I didn't. Calm down. Don't you realize that the only thing you need in this world is his love? Uh, well, his love, and a stun gun, and some cybernetic arms, and, uh, yeah. Those odd lovers get in my face now, I'm ready to pop. Grace, where he at these days? Yo, where you been, man? He been running shit through that abandoned gas station for weeks. Oh, word, I wanted to get some upgrades for my Zenith 10 mil. He can hook you up nice, man. If you go, tell him I sent you. I want a discount next time. Word. What's up, guys? Punks. Let's check these dudes out. They got some... So, cyberpunk. We've had the cyber. Now, we get the punk. Putting the punk in cyberpunk. Great. Nice hair, bro. That's looking very... Well, it's looking very punk. I'll give it to you. Yo, you look like the man who knows where to find that good shit. Upgrades, weapons, stuff like that. Don't worry, it's all good. I just need it for protection. Don't worry, it's all good. I just need what it for protection. What you need, player? Protection. Because I know where you can cop some goods. If you want some. Wait a second. You ain't a cop, are you? Just forget I said anything. Seriously, do I look like a cop? I guess I, I probably, within this milieu, do look like a cop. I look like a badass, though. 
tell you that much right now. You know what those guys aren't trying to do? They ain't trying to rob this guy. <laughs> Somebody's missing, but can't read that. Makes me wonder, like, hey, how much stuff is hidden around, like, up on things that you're expected to jump to or get to through some clever, you know, st you know, stacking of junk or whatever. Here's a door. Danger, high voltage. Danger, danger. Alright, so I was just going to look at my map real quick. Where am I? Oh, I've actually gone pretty far away from Seraph. Let's just back it up here. Oh, what's this? Oh! <laughs> I just found Detective Chase's building. Inadvertently. Well, okay. I found Chase. Time to see if he'll talk to an ex-cop about Megan's case. I don't really want to do this yet. So, instead, I'm going to leave. I'm going to head back towards the direction I came from. So I can sort of explore the city and everything in a more methodical in a more methodical manner, I was going to say, but then I realized way too much alliteration there. <laughs> like that's some sort of sin or crime. I already looked over here. Don't know why I'm looking over here again. This is just a thing that I do. 352 a gallon. I've seen it worse. Call us for quality demolition. I'm on your car, people. I'm on your car. Should have got an alarm. Phone booths. Nothing, uh... Police line, do not cross. I'm crossing it. Hey, I'm up on the phone booth. Bicycles. I regret my augmentation. Ah, oh, it's a sign from one of the protesters. Am I close to the, um... Oh yeah, there's the limb clinic right down the street. So this is where the protesters were. Humanity's biggest mistake. Street protest. No to artificial evolution. Stop playing God. Hmm. Electric vehicle charging station. Vehicle class A. Vehicle class B. The good Lord made you in his own image. Why would you desecrate yourself? Heard that before. Don't you realize that the only thing you need in this world is his love? I, I don't actually realize that, in fact. Who's this guy? He looks... shady. You know who's behind these attacks on Seraph Industries, don't you? Same people who faked 9 11. <laughs> still, still going on with that conspiracy theory, huh? They want us scared, man. They want every person in the Western world terrified some terrorist's going to attack us in our homes. Well, they probably do want that, they actually, want us but. Scared, man. They want every person in the Western world terrified some terrorist's going to attack us in our homes. I'm going to tell you something right now. As a rule, I am not going to drink a beer that I just pulled out of a trash can. I'm just, <laughs> just let you know, I have not sunk that low, and I don't intend to. There's a newspaper dispenser. Oh, cool. It just spits out a, a, new, a new newspaper with new stories on it. That's awesome. Uh, okay, so biohazard bomb triggered. It's, oh, no, this is the story of how I let all those people die. Tragedy struck Seraph Industries in Milwaukee Junction this evening as a homemade biological explosive planted by pro-human extremists was detonated, killing several employees. 
It was completely unexpected, commented Sergeant Neil Townsend, chief of the tactical unit. They were much better organized than we had anticipated. Eyewitnesses slammed Townsend's team for reacting too slowly to the situation. The criticism underscores the considerable problems facing a department that is still blamed for mishandling a similar standoff two years ago in Mexican town when a SWAT team killed a 15-year-old teen igniting a city-wide riot. And that's the thing that everyone keeps making reference to, that where I was there. You know, Adam Jensen was there, and that's the event that precipitated him quitting this. So did he kill? Did I kill the the 15-year-old? I don't know. Probably so. That would probably explain a lot about why he quit and so on. And why everybody keeps bringing it up as though it was his fault. When asked if fears of rekindling public unrest prevented him from acting any sooner, Townsend declined comment. Anti-Og terrorist at large, the mastermind behind today's hostage-taking at Seraph Industries is on the loose. He is being hunted by local, state, and federal law enforcement agencies. A decorated ex-Marine, Ezekiel Zeke Sanders is the leader of a group of militant pro-human activists known as Purity First. So these headlines, this newspaper, is reactive to what I actually did. I would have gotten different headlines on here if I had gone early and saved those people and if I had maybe killed him instead of... Oh, that's pretty neat. The world reacts to what I do. Good game design, people. More newspapers? Same? Same newspaper? How about this one? Same newspaper? Okay. There's only one newspaper in this world. And it's the Pikus Daily Standard. One globe, one source for news. They're not kidding. They really are the one source for news. Okay. And there's the gas station again. And that's the way to the clinic. Oh, whoa. That, that opera looks pretty sweet. I've seen the ads for the... And that's the one that the guy had the two tickets for. So I'm not actually, I'm not actually gonna go over to the limb clinic right now. Yet. I'm gonna back it up. Gonna back it up. Dan Luca ex exhibition. It's an art gallery, I guess. Shanti energy drink. Hey. Can I? Oh, I find a secret area? Oh. No, I just found the same old damn area I was already in. I don't know what all this is about, but I found a little a little crawly bit here, and it did not give me any special hidden stuff, so that disappoints me. I'll get over it, though. Nominate. Nominate, 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 nominate. Om nom nominate. Let me guess. Same one? Yeah. Am I going to click on every newspaper dispenser I find in town, even though I know they're all going to give me the same one? Yes, I am. So look at this poor fellow. What's going on with his life? He doesn't seem to be doing too well. Hey, uh, I can't even... I'll just let him sleep. I'll let him sleep. What's up, cop? Keep that weapon holstered, sir. We've had enough action. Yeah, I'll keep my weapon holstered. Relax. What's up here? Oh, that's where the rail station and stuff is. Well, let's come up here and... Uh, well, let's come up here and end this video. Because that's all the time I have for this one. Thank you for watching. Josiah plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. We'll see you next time.